Hey curlies, it is Curly Lock and I'm just gonna make a really quick video, kind of like update you guys on what I've been doing, um, hair, skin, all of that. Um, pardon the little, I have cleanser on my face right now because I felt a bump kind of forming and I wanted to tackle it actually before it formed all the way. So that is why you see this little white patch on my face right now. But anyway, I just kind of wanted to update you guys on what I've been doing. Um, my regimen hasn't changed much, um, but I have some new products that I'm going to be trying. And um, so, yeah, I'm going to jump right into this. Um, as far as supplements are concerned, I am still taking my MSM Sulfur, which you can get from um, D Health Store. And I will put a link in the description box for those of you who are interested in trying the MSM Sulfur. Um, I'll put that information for you. I have not been using the Nature's Bounty Extra Strength Hair, Skin, and Nails Vitamins um, as often as I was before, like I should. I'm actually going to start back using them again, but I just haven't. For one, they're kind of big. I'll show you what they look like. Um, I don't like really horse pills. They're not super duper big, but because they're not like capsules like the MSM Sulfur, I've gagged on them a couple of times and so just kind of lost interest in taking them, but I really need to go back to taking these on a regular basis. So I'm going to, because um, I have this bottle and then I have a bigger bottle that I got from Costco. Um, I get these from Walgreens. But I got on here because I wanted to show you guys this new product that I just got. Um, it's by um, Tropic Isle Living, the Jamaica Black Castor Oil Protein Conditioner. This is what the jar looks like. I actually already use their Jamaica Black Castor Oil and their organic coconut oil. Um, so I decided I was going to try this because I need another like protein conditioner. I have a lot of deep conditioners, but I have a lot of like moisturizing deep conditioners and not really like a lot of protein deep conditioners. So I thought I would try this because I love the castor oil and I love the coconut oil. So I just got this. I haven't used it yet. I opened it up. Look, it looks like conditioner. It's, it's a creamy cons consistency, like, a, you know, like a regular conditioner, but it smells god awful. Oh my God. It stinks so bad. Um, <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I'm apprehensive to use it because it really, really stinks really, really bad. And I almost can't even describe to you what it smells like. It almost smells like rotten mayonnaise. I just, I don't like if you've left mayonnaise sitting out for a few days and it starts to sour. That is what this smells like. And I'm very apprehensive to using it, but I really need to try another protein conditioner. So I'm going to try it. I might steam with it and hopefully it has some amazing results. I thought about mixing it with something to cut the odor, but I don't want to take the effect of the protein away from the conditioner, so I'm, I plan on using it as is, but it really stinks. Um, this right here, um, this is actually my Tree Hut Shea Sugar Body Scrub container, but that's not what's in here. What's in here is my mixture of the silicone mix and the canicone. And in my conditioner video, I mentioned that I hadn't tried it yet, but that I was going to try it. I've used it twice. And it's just easier for me to mix it up in here. And I love this conditioner. I love the way my hair felt after I put it on. Actually, the next time I mix some more up, I'm thinking about adding a little bit of EVOO to it and steaming with that. Um, but before I do that, I'm going to do a, a protein. I haven't done a protein conditioner since I went back curly after I flat ironed my hair. So I really need a protein conditioner. Um, another simple rinse out conditioner that I um, thought about trying. I haven't tried it yet. I just bought it the other day. Drugstore conditioner and it's just the Suave Professionals. 100% um, natural almond and shea butter. It's the almond and shea butter um, formula. Uh, moisturizing for dry damaged hair. Um, so I'm going to try this. I've had excellent results with the Trust and May Naturals. I've had excellent re results with the Aussie um, three minute miracle deep conditioner so I just I can't say enough about these drugstore conditioners they're really giving these other high price brands a run for their money because they've been doing um, excellently in my hair so this is what I'm going to be trying next I'm going to do a co-wash um, with this so yeah just a few things I wanted to get on here really quick and show you guys I found this cute little 
Vaseline that you can just throw in your purse. This is like my second little jar of it. I have one in my purse right now. So um, I condition my lips with this every night. I put this on my lips every night before I go to bed. So um, yeah, just a really quick video. My battery is dying. I just wanted to get on here really fast to show you guys some of those things, kind of update you on what I've been doing. Like I said, my regimen has not changed. I'm just implementing some, some more products and I'm going to shave all those products down because I've pretty much found what I really, really like. Um, people keep asking me to review stuff so um really quickly back to the msm sulfur is it's good to um take this with orange juice the vitamin c helps you absorb the msm sulfur in your system so um yeah really really fast i'm done i'm going to go wash this off my face and i will see you guys in my next video have a good one bye